Okay, Les, you uh, ended up uh, bubbling with World Chalice, right? Exactly. Anything you want to say before you go to the list? Um, not really, I love the stack. It's really, really complex, so there were times I misplayed somewhat and didn't end up mattering, but sometimes I lost the game because of it. Right. Um, I think this stack is really, really good, but most players don't tend to play it because it's just too hard for them. Right. So. Okay. Yeah, let's see this. Alright, so we are playing three world shadows. So this card special summons two monsters from the deck, so you need to play it. Um, two puppy. Uh, some people tend to forget it's a hand trap actually, it protects you from targeting. Um, it mattered in a round I played against the uh, strikers. They try to anchor one of my cards and they just negate it. So it's really good. One knee it searches any World Chalice card, so really powerful. Armor. And uh, one normal. You need at least two targets for this one, and I don't want to brick them, so uh, that's the way to go, I think. Um, now we are playing some dangers. They are three special summons and uh, triple fodder uh, for, for World Chalice, so you can just triple them off for it. Um, really, really nice. And just free link for the also, so yeah, no reason not to play. Also, what's important is they are level 3, and um, later on that will matter, uh, and I will explain why. Right. Uh, two defect dragons. Um, it's literally a danger, but also a dragon, so you can make guard dragon plays with it, so really, really nice. Uh, three dragon Um it's a it's an instant synchro if synchro so yeah really good three mathematician same reasoning you want to get to the if synchro as fast as possible so it's really good um, and one brick right <laughs> so another brick this one we sent with mathematician to banish it and um, special some Galaxy Surface for uh, Synchro 5 players. Uh, one Dino Wrestler Kuolasila. Um, this one can special summon itself for free. Uh, it's a level 2 tuna. And you cannot use it for Link summoning, so it's just there for the Synchro. Right. Uh, one Red MD, one Rota, and one. The Strudel. Yeah, I wish, I wish that was for guard dragon players mostly. Okay. One Christia researches card uh, in the combo. And this is something I've put in last second. Uh, the Kaiju Waterfront engine. And I thought uh, the banners was shortly before this event, so I thought people would tend to decks like through Draco. Alter guys, sub terra, easy decks, or sky strikers. So I felt like Christia wasn't enough, yeah. and that's why I played this. But I didn't even play against any back row deck. I played mostly against Orcus or Thunder Dragons and Salami. You no, know, it, it was that most of the time, so it sucked. But okay. yeah. Three sided mining, search a straight connect, so we are using it that one. Two fossil deck. Uh, we want to search for Lasselat, uh, the Dino Wrestler guy, and Carbonetto. Carbonetto is great if we can discard it with the uh, uh, danger, because then we can banish it from the graveyard to special summon uh, this one and just go to the right. Place. Free um, unexpected die. We want to get to a tuna as fast as possible. Uh, we can special summon them with this card and with uh, World Chalice Scar Dragon. That's why we need the Vanilla Dragon Tuna. And yeah. Another target for the Synchro Search and also. Um, with this card, if it's in the graveyard, you can banish it and search it. So in grind games, it came up so often just to revise stuff I needed back. Right. Go for game. 
Monster Reborn. One foolish sending Lee or the Carbonadon or other cards. Really great card. Uh, Dragon Ruby, searching for Romulus. And two Cosmic Cyclones, just utility. So that's the main deck. Yeah. Yeah, we are playing Sayuya, obviously because of the well, that fix that one. Um, because of uh, Christia and Gamasil, we want to special some of them with this card. Uh, one it. We want to get to it as fast as possible. Well Charles now is more of a deck like we want to get to it synchro so we can further extend our place the core of the deck. Um, a Palooza. So now I'm tending to make uh, a Palooza first before making any guard dragon plays because uh, it stops hand traps and most hand traps. Usually p people wait until they see the guard dragons to hit them with the hand traps and if I just make a Palooza they cannot do that so right. really nice. Um, then the guard dragons. And this one? Yeah, they are there. Uh, our World Chalice Link Monsters are Imdark and Ip. Uh, Imdark gives us a second normal sum, so just good overall. And this one is just easy to make and the combo we needed, so yeah. Then Phoenix for utility. So Link Spider because we can use the Nibiru token for this one and just play it through Nibiru at times. So it's really nice. Um, Cherubini. Uh, so for starters, Draconet and Mathematician. Uh, so this one is level 3. And if they ash it and uh, something like. Too dangerous in hand or something like that, or just a way to get two three something onto the field. I can go into Cherubini and send Carbonan to the graveyard to get to my level five synchro. So it's great utility just to have. Right. And, yeah, FA down Drexler because yeah, he played Strudel, Why not? Um, triple burst, Romulus. Yeah, this one is just so we can link off the guard ranks and if we want to make this, we make this at the time. It's good against strikers and the zones it points to is really nice if we are under the guard ranks, so yeah. I was playing Boros all the yes, with And last two cards, Borlock, Dragon and uh, Salaman Great Army Rush. So we usually normal summon this one and it's has less than 1000 attacks so we can just link off and run rush to control no other monsters. So that's the idea behind this one. And um, I like this one and this deck more than a Borrowed Sword Dragon just because we tend to have big monsters on the field with the help of a Red MD. So Red MD has 2800 attacks so OTK is usually quite easy with it. And I felt like Borrowed Dragon was just better against certain matchups like Thunder Dragon, Stealing Colossus and something like that. Um, side deck was free ash, I didn't main any hand traps because I didn't have any space there. And I still want to do something against certain decks with ash bosses, so I side the three Panker tops. Um, I went between this one and uh, Mind Control. This one is better in certain matchups and Mind Control just is really good against um, Thunder Dragons. I decided to oh, Panker Tops, but it could be either way to be honest. Three Nibiru, blows away some decks, so yeah. And we have really, really hard times against back row heavy decks. And that's why three Twin Twister and three Red Reboots are needed for the stack. Um, it's like a strike that's much, much more than any Ash could ever do. 
Ash, for example, doesn't kill the monster on the field. So we can still go into, go into Charmin or something like that. Uh, that's why I felt like security, stopping strikes, judgments or something like that, back row, overall is much more needed than stopping hand traps, so I didn't play caught by the way. So that was my decision. Okay, any last words? Any shout outs? Uh, shout outs to the World Shadows Discord channel that really helped me out and yeah, that's all I can say. Okay, uh, Les, thanks for the list. Congrats. No problem.